morning, I would like to introduce you all to my Chanel perfume collection uh, that I collect since I came to Saudi Arabia. Uh, I've been introduced by Chanel perfume about six years ago. Uh, and for not further ado, we will start with my first uh, perfume that I bought from Chanel and that is this uh, Coco Mademoiselle. This perfume is uh, 50 milliliter or 1.7 fluid ounce and it retails when I bought this it was 400 plus Saudi Rials but the latest uh, retails now for 50 milliliter is 546 Saudi Rials. All my perfumes usually I will buy it uh, from Sephora uh, store in lots of malls in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia. Almost all the big malls in Riyadh, they have a Sephora store and I bought it from there. So this is the perfume. MashaAllah, I love from the first sight when I um, smell this perfume. This perfume introduced uh, for me by my colleagues. She is a Canadian. We working together as a nurse at one of the hospital in Riyadh. But now she already resigned and went back to Canada. So she introduced to me this perfume and start from that, I fall in love. I always use this perfume. Um, it has a lot of uh, patchouli, tonka bean and also orange. The smell is really fruity and sweet. I know lots of um, women in the world use this perfume because it is one of the best seller in Chanel uh, perfumes. Um, it's, it's not, uh, um, for me, it's fine. If lots of uh, women are using it, I don't mind. Means that this perfume is great for them and it's long lasting for my skin. I love it so much and this is uh, Coco Mademoiselle original. Coco Mademoiselle, Coco Mademoiselle also uh, introduced another two more uh, flankers for the Coco Mademoiselle and one of it is Coco Mademoiselle Beauty Parfum Intense. It stated underneath the bottle. So this bottle is 100 milliliter or 3.4 fluid ounce and the retail for this perfume is around 700 plus when i bought this perfume it's still about 500 plus uh, two years back um, oh, mashallah. this smells is stronger than the original uh, coco mademoiselle it's really strong more patchouli with the tonki be uh, with the tonka beans i just can smell a little bit of orange in this uh, perfume i used to uh, use this perfume during night time especially during winter time in saudi um, yeah this is nice smell i love it um, some of the people doesn't like it because it's too strong but it's really nice and the name is intense means it's a stronger than the original one so this is Coco Mademoiselle Beauty Parfum Intense in 100ml Next, under Coco Mademoiselle There is the latest one that came out I think in 2020 or yeah, in 2020 and the name of this uh, perfume is Coco Mademoiselle Le Preve Low Preve has been introduced for bedtime sleeping, okay, for bedtime. And then actually as a consumer, when we buy a perfume, we can use it anytime we want. Either that perfume is supposed to be night time, but we can use it anytime that we want. Same as this, this perfume as well, Low Preve. Um, the longevity of, long, uh, of Low Preve is a little bit... Uh, shorter maybe about two hours is some of the people for myself is about two hours and I used to wear this perfume before I went for sleep 
uh, I'm working night shift so the time that uh, my sleeping is uh, different uh, from the others I will sleep in the morning and wake up in the evening then start to go to work again so this perfume when I apply it is really make me uh, comfortable uh, calm and easy for me to go to sleep after shower so I love this perfume so much this is a uh, 50 milliliter in 1.7 fluid ounce and then the price was that time when I bought about 500 plus uh, Saudi Rials and the bottle is a little bit different from the original uh, Coco Mademoiselle it's the other way around if you see for the original Coco Mademoiselle the stopper is a frosted glass and the bottle itself is a clear glass but for the low preve the stopper is the clear glass and the bottle is frosted glass besides that at the back of the uh, low preve they print out the ingredients on the bottle but not on the original um, Coco Mademoiselle so there is the three uh, perfume under Coco Mademoiselles. So now I want to introduce you to the mother or the first uh, perfume um, created by Gabrielle Chanel in 1921 and the name is Chanel number no. 5. Chanel number no. 5 is the first, um, not the first, but along a lot of the um, uh, perfume that they prepare uh, Gabrielle Chanel choose number five uh, perfume that uh, the most uh, or the one that she want to produce it's not because of the name number five but the number of the perfumes that the, they prepare the, the perfumers prepare she choose the one that number five so the name of the perfume is number five the color of the juice is a little bit orangey and this is the bottle this is 50 milliliter bottle or 1.7 fluid ounce uh, bottles and the price when i bought this about three years ago it was 400 plus uh, saudi rials it's a nice and strong powdery with the mask, uh, white mask, um, jasmine especially. So I bought this perfume not because I love the smell. I can't use, I mean, I it's too strong uh, smells for my skin. So I'm not using this perfume every day. I just bought it because I am a collector of a Chanel perfume. So. I think that I must have one at least uh, number five Chanel so I bought the smallest bottle 50 milliliter just to keep it uh, I maybe I use one or two times but I'm not using it outside I just use it when I'm at home because it's too powdery I I really can't take the smell out only in my house in my studio house in my room so this is the number five Chanel so for the last, I think, two or three years, Chanel introduced this perfume and Wallah Al-Azim, I love, love, love this perfume. This is number five Chanel Low. And this is 100 milliliter bottles or 3.4 uh, fluid ounce bottle. And this is not UD Parfum. This is UD Toilet. For my surprise, this perfume are long lasting on my skin. It's about 6 hours last when I'm applying this perfume. And from the word low, and it is in French, means water. You can see the juice are clear water color. And I love it so much with the clear color of the bottles. It's nice, right? The price for this um, Chanel Number no. Five Low 100 milliliter is 746 Saudi rials. 
Masya Allah, the smells are divine. So I have the uh, note here that I got it from uh, Chanel website. Uh, number 5 low is a modern, fresh and vibrant, vibrant of new era of Chanel number no. 5. It composed by perfumer Mr. Olivier Polch. Uh, the top notes of this uh, EDT are lemon, mandarin and orange. These three uh, fruits are my favorite fruits to eat and also the smells, Alhamdulillah. So the mid notes for these uh, perfumes are rose, jasmine and ylang ylang. And the base notes are soft musk. I love, love, love this perfume. Um, I bought the big bottle. So inshallah, um, by next week or another week, I will try to get the twist and spray uh, number 5 low. So I can bring it in my purse and it's easy for me. So inshallah, I will try to get it. And this is number 5 low. To consumer, to everyone, any woman or any man that love or can stand the number five uh, chanel the original number five chanel you can try number five low i guarantee you 100 percent inshallah you will find this uh smells uh mashallah is so good for you i'm using this almost every day uh, even when i'm off after shower i will use this and i start to clean my house something like that it still uh stay with me and i've tried this perfume during my day shift 12 hours i have to reapply for day shift but when i'm working night shift for 12 hours alhamdulillah no need for me to reapply this uh perfume and it stay stays with me for about 11 10 to 11 hours i love this and this is chanel number five low so now we go to my another collection of a perfume by chanel and this is coco from chanel this is It's really spicy, spicy smell and I love it. I love it so much. Uh, sometimes I will use this uh, perfume uh, when I go to work or when I have something or any uh, occasion in the hospital that I have to go immediately, then I will use this one. This is a uh, 50 milliliter bottles or 1.7 fluid ounce and the retail is 546 Saudi Rials as the latest one. Because this, I bought it last week and I started to use it last week and I love it so much. A bit spicy with the patchouli. More jasmine as well. So, uh, lots of people uh, that I know love this Coco by Chanel. I try to get the variety of Coco, like um, shower foam, uh, body cream, uh, body lotion, uh, body soap. I will try to get it and then inshallah, if the, my collection is full and complete, I will do another video about uh, Coco by Chanel. Then I want to introduce to you all this uh, perfume. This is Coco Noir by Chanel. I love this bottle so much. It's really nice black color bottle. For myself, this is uh, my opinion. Um, the perfume that is in the dark color uh, bottles like black or dark purple or very dark red is usually is very intense and we use it during the cold weather uh, winter time or uh, and at night because it is very intense strong uh, smells of the perfume same like this coco noir oh mashallah i love it slight spicy not too spicy like coco slight spicy i bought this together with coco and few times i use this uh when i went out for dinner 
uh, and uh, roaming around with my friends in uh, winter time now in Saudi Arabia and this is Coco Noah. The price also the same 546 Saudi Rials, uh, 1.73 ounce 50 milliliter bottles. Love it. Okay, um, I have only two perfume from the La Exclusive by Chanel. These two uh, perfume, these two smells are the most um, uh, suitable for my skin, most suitable for myself and for my smells. And the two are beige and gardenia. So for the beige, uh, beige is a Coco Chanel favorite color and it's an intense floral accord of Houghton and Frangipani with the notes of honey. So beige uh, one of the Chanel, uh, Gabriel Chanel uh, favorite color uh, especially to her house in uh, Paris and also at her store also in Paris. So that's why this um, perfume, she named it as a beige. MashaAllah. I love this smell because it's really long lasting to my skin. It's really soft, not too strong smell. And the smells of honey is just a little bit, not too much. I love it, love it so much. Unfortunately, I bought only the 75 mils bottles so the price for 75 mils bottle in the chanel boutique in riyadh especially at al nakil mall the price was 916 saudi rials 916 inshallah i think the next month i will buy the 200 mils bottle for me to keep then this is for my travel because it's only 75 mils ah, Ah, I love it so much. I love it, love it so much. And this one, this is the most favorite, favorite Chanel from La Exclusive that I love. And this is Gardenia by La Exclusive Chanel. So this is 200 mist bottle. The smells are divine. The price for this uh, La Exclusive Gardenia is... 1657 Saudi Rials and you can get it from the Chanel boutique in Al Nakhil Mall Riyadh Saudi Arabia so for Gardenia um, Chanel love love camellia flower unfortunately camellia doesn't have scent so Chanel change uh, because want to make a uh, perfume Chanel change uh, the uh, flower to gardenia because gardenia have a scent so it is um, luxurious floral scents it started in 1925 by Coco Chanel and Ernest Bu so the notes for these uh, perfumes are citrus lanolol and citron eugenol lemon and mimosa also gardenia I love love this smell so much I know it's expensive but I still want to buy it. I still want to have it in my um, collection. I use this as uh, when the um, a special occasion only. And the from the research that I did and from the some of the YouTubers that I uh, listened to their video uh, lots of people who are getting married love to use this perfume as their wedding perfumes so um, because gardenia uh, transform a pure pure heart so uh, wedding are a pure uh, relationship between uh, men and wife men and woman so they choose gardenia and inshallah maybe one day if i got married inshallah gardenia by chanel is it will be uh, my uh, perfume of choice inshallah 
so thank you so much for everyone who are watching my video uh, thank you again uh, I hope you all um, are having uh, fun with the video with the few uh, information about my Chanel collection uh, inshallah uh, next time I will do more video about uh, perfumes or a skincare uh, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart Please like this video and subscribe for my channel. Thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Bye.